Hello you guys, and welcome back to my walkthrough for South Park. The Stick of Truth. <laughs> We're moving on to go to the Taco Bell. <laughs> we know it's not Taco Bell. But that's what they're saying it is. Obviously the government. Koopa Keep. Got our house here. Oh, nope, that's Butter's house. Our house is here. So I was just looking for a fast travel, <laughs> which here is one of the fast travels. And where is the closest thing? I think it's here. So I'm going to take this time to thank you guys for viewing my video. If you haven't um, already subscribed, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Drop a like and a comment. I do comment back, so you can do that. <laughs> I get butter the already, best wet willy over there one time. <laughs> if you haven't already, go ahead and watch the rest of my videos for South Park. Folks, there's nothing to be concerned with here. Absolutely nothing out of the ordinary is going on. We're simply getting ready for the grand opening of a new Taco Bell. New Taco Bell opening soon. Very big Taco Bell. It's gonna open in a few weeks. Thank you. Uh, will this Taco Bell be serving in Chiritos? What? Well, is it gonna be a full menu Taco Bell or is this gonna be one of those Taco Bell KFC combos? We got a guy out here asking a lot of questions. <laughs> Just stick to the script as laid out in the protocol. But he wants to know if the Taco Bell will have Inchiritos or not, sir. Damn it, we don't have a contingency for that. Michaels, isolate and neutralize the threat. Yes, sir. Look, it's a simple question. If this is going to be a huge Taco Bell, will it serve Inchiritos? I think we have a right to know. <laughs> Mark? Uh, Folks, we know you're all very excited, but for your safety, we ask you stay clear of the construction site. Mark? They could have just said yes or no. You need to use Sneaky Squeaker to get past the guards, but Sneaky Squeaker selected. <laughs> okay. Oh, shit, we can loot him? Okay. Control the fart. Where is the fart? Oh, there it is. Ah. Control the fart with left stick. When the fart is where you want it, use A to detonate. Anyone highlighted by the fart when you detonate it will run over to it. Scuzzlebutt? Seriously? Is that you, God? What was that? He didn't see us walk by. <laughs> That's pretty funny. This place doesn't really look like a Taco Bell. Oh, we can electrocute him. Did I just fart? Or was I just thinking about farting? <laughs> yes. Anything that care to pick up? A 
moon rock. Oh, so you can lock them in there as well. Well, I see a probe. A stone hammer and a rusty pipe. Hmm, we'll have to go through our inventory. Looks like there's a way to get up here. Or in there from up here. The sheet ogre is no more. The elves, uh, all elves can walk the land of Larnian safely once again. Perfect attack reduces shields. Hmm. Target starts bleeding on perfect attack. Well, I know it's a little bit better, but let's just keep the current weapon we have. But I think there are some other modifiers that we picked up. Adds 50 frost damage on perfect attack. Yep. <laughs> we want that. Is there anything we can switch this out for? That's 25 frost damage. Well, why not? That'll add 70 frost damage. Yeah, that looks good to me. <laughs> looks good to me. But so far, we've been unable to stop the UFO from leaking the toxic waste. We've contained all we can, but there are no guarantees an outbreak will not occur. And does the alien liquid appear to have the same effect as last time? I'm afraid so. When the alien waste reacts with organic material on Earth, it turns things into... Nazi zombies. Here we go again. God damn it. I'm so tired of Nazi zombies. It's so overused. If the wrong person gets their hands on that green toxin, it could totally spread it. We have a big problem. All right, we're gonna have to completely obliterate everything in a three block radius. Find locations for the bombs and bury it all. Then make up a fake story about an earthquake. We can contain the outbreak this time if we act quickly enough. Let's move. Everything we've just talked about has been recorded onto this tape. I'm going to leave it alone here for a few minutes, then come back later and have it encrypted and locked away so nobody ever hears what was said in this meeting. Yes, good idea. <laughs> that means go for the recorder. What the fuck? It's broken free! Ah! Oh, shit. <laughs> and now we have to fight another zombie. Let's go, dude. Big Meet to holy, immune to gross. You got somewhere you'd rather be? No. Let's mug him. You mind if I update my status while we're waiting here? <laughs> I do. Mm, Are we we'll playing just... or what? Kill. Pentagram patch? I think that's what it said. Swat fist. Okay, so let's take a look at our new weapons. Well, not our new weapons, I mean our new 
Oh my gosh. Attack again when an enemy dies. Hmm, this actually has quite a bit of good things on here. So let's... Let's, uh, remove all patches. And equip our tactical gloves. So what is it? It's uh, minus 15% damage when blocking and adds 10% armor, reducing enemy attacks. So what do we got? What we want to put on here? Melee weapon attacks inflict 50 more damage. Yeah, we'll do that. And it's more like a a warrior, uh, what a warrior would use. Gain ability up when below 15% hit points and adds 30 armor reducing enemy attack. We'll um, yeah, we'll increase our hit points. And our SWAT gear attack again when an enemy dies. Ah, but that doesn't have modifier. We'll try this for now. Obviously, we we'll want to go in here first. Man, this secret government base room sure is boring. You'd think that a secret government base would have more cool stuff in it. Tesla coil. Oh, there's a collectible. <laughs> Gunrilla. So, let's open this. Was it the? It must have been a weapon modifier. Adds 50 shock damage on perfect attack. So, <laughs> oh, do we actually want to? You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna keep the frost damage on here, and then our ranged weapon will change it. We'll change it to the Tesla coil. There. Better. We already looted this. I think we're done in this room now. And you know what? This is actually going to be it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I will see you in the next one.